guys, Mix Media Girl here. So today we're doing video number three in the series of the Master's Touch Premixed Pouring Paint. And if you didn't see the first two, I'll post the links in the description. Today we are going to be doing a tree ring. I'm not going to be adding any of their cell medium. I do have a little bit of leftover paint from the first experiment that I did with this. So I'm gonna go ahead and just use that. And I'm basically using up pretty much most of the remaining paints in the bottles. Um, this will be primarily cool colors because this kit is primarily cool colors. And I just think a tree ring will look gorgeous. So it's gonna take me a minute to go ahead and layer all these colors in here. So I'll just speed this part up. got all my colors in here so primarily cool colors but a little bit of the gold and the red in there which I think will give it a nice touch I do actually really like the consistency of this paint it's not too watery not too thick so I definitely think it has some promise it would be nice if it produced reactions on its own but like I said in the first video, I've noticed that with the pre-mixed pouring paints, a lot of times they don't have reactions on their own. They need that cell activator. So that's kind of to be expected. But out of the pre-mixed pouring paints that I've tried thus far, this is probably in my top three. It's actually pretty nice. Awesome. I'm really happy with that. As I suspected, great for tree rings. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this sit here for a little bit. We'll see if anything develops and then we'll do our close up. All right, we're back here for our close up. I'm very happy with the lines in this. I think it's beautiful. It would be nice if there was a bit more variety of colors in the kit, but seeing as I do love cool colors, it's nice that that was primarily the colors in the kit. Lines look beautiful. So very happy with this paint for tree rings. All right, guys, go ahead and check out videos one and two with these paints if you haven't yet. I hope you enjoyed these experiments and I'll see you next time.